Hello everyone, hope you're watching well today and welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be discussing something that's definitely going to be controversial for many people. And that being the Kingdom Ducks class Wasp Needle. So if y'all can remember back in early this year, I think it was in January, something like that. Yeah, January this year, we got a leak listing just saying every, uh, every figure that we were supposed to expect for Kingdom this year. And one of those leaks was a Ducks class Wasp Needle. And all these months later, we've got another news on the topic until now. So without further ado, Let's talk about the leaked images of Transformers Kingdom Deluxe Class Wash Tornado. And oh boy, yeah, this is a uh, this is a mixed bag right here. So let's just dive into this, shall we? Um, so first thing that I'm kind of mixed on is the colors of the figure. Some areas looks good, some areas looks really really bad. So let's take these wings for example. They all they, they appear to be a transparent purple plastic. Um. I don't know why they chose to do that, other than like they might have tried to take inspiration from his um his bluish purple eyes from the original Beast Wars cartoon show, but that's really it, and it it just doesn't look that good up as especially with the uh, green and the yellow color they chose. Moving on to that green color, I it, it just looks too dark for the character. Uh, in the show, Wasp Middle was a much b more vibrant color green, and while I understand that Kingdom isn't trying to be Beast Wars. It's taking the OG designs, giving them super realistic heads, and then stylizing everything else. While well, I understand that, it just it just doesn't look like a good combination of colors, honestly, in my opinion. But the bot mode putting aside the coloration does look pretty good, honestly. Of course, it does have all the uh, core central aspects of his OG design, such as the molding, the eyes and the chest, the arch proportions and the legs and the head and the wings. So, you know, with, with the molding-wise, it's fine, but the coloration is really killing it for me. But moving on to an image of him in his fly mode, um, you know, it, it, it does look good, um, again, I'm not much of a bug guy, so I can't tell you if this looks, uh, how a real life fly should look, but as far as I've seen through pictures and such, this does look pretty accurate how an actual house fly would commonly look, um, cause he's a, I mean, I, I, honestly, guys, I don't know what to say for this uh, mode. I don't know much about bugs at all, so I can't really commentate on it in terms of accuracy to an actual animal like what these kingdom figures are going for. But as far as I can tell, it does look pretty good, besides, of course, those odd colors. And finally, to end it off, I want to talk about this last image here. So, obviously, here is the new kingdom leaked version compared to the, of course, CGI design, the Thrilling 30 version, and what I believe to be the uh, original 90s toy. So, here's the big question everyone's going to be asking after this news goes, like, the everyone's ears. What is the best version? Because, you know, we haven't had too many wash videos in the last couple of years, so I'm too many to choose from. So, obviously, people can want the best. So, in my personal opinion, this might be controversial, I'm not entirely sure. But I think that the Thrilling 31 does still hold the cake. And... You know, that's good and bad in both ways, because it's bad because I think this is like a 10-year-old figure, or something like that, eight, ten 10-year-old figure, if I'm not wrong. So I think Hasbro, what they really should have done is taken that mold and colors and just based it off of that, because that mold was pretty good, it was pretty accurate. And I know that the Kingdom, like I said, that was the title of the video, isn't supposed to be Beast Wars, and I understand that, it's just, you know, I think if those taking the characters from Beast Wars, I think they should just take a little bit more inspiration from that and base the figures off of that. But th that's just my personal take. I'm not entirely sure if that's going to be uh, popular or not. That's just what I see. So there you go, guys. That was my quick, quick little take on the new leaks for the Kingdom Wash Tornado. So let me know what you guys thought down below in the comment section up, uh, below. I can't see right now. I'm so sorry. My nose is clogged. I can barely speak. Um, well, let me know what you guys thought down below. Um... Do you think his figure looks good? Do you think it looks bad? Colors are good, colors are bad. Let's let me know in the comment section below. With that being said, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Sorry the audio was bad in this video. I'm still congested. And I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys. Have a good day.